Panda is creeping closer and closer to his uh, Agamemnon Scepter. And if he gets that, it's going to be a uh, big trouble. I think he is 1100 away. He has Staff of Wizard in base. Um, let me see how much gold he has. Oh, he has it. He has it. I think that's big trouble. That's big trouble for uh, the MYM team. Because once he split, that Fire Panda just does so much. Um, but if, if Freerun could get a, a, a good Sprout in, if they stun it, if they Cyclone it, do anything. If just, just disable that Fire Panda. I think that's going to be okay. Um, but it, it just it just one more target to worry about. One more stun to, to be wasted. Something like that. Um, <clears throat> So I think NYM team now is kind of going back. They, they, they're they going to go for Roshan too. Yeah, they're going to go for Roshan too. <laughs> so um, I'm going to take it this moment to, since this is my 100th video, I want to thank everyone who has been sticking around uh, watching me do commentaries for so long. Looks like the Sentinel team is probably going to go. And if they, they're clumped around so much, a torrent and ship will be very easily to hit, even though there is an army uh, of people guarding there it's gonna torrent and ship uh, they should back out torrent hits oh ship hits they should know oh ship misses somehow and then now now pusher gets ultimated a war goes down in the middle of everything it's, oh they're gonna go for pusher pusher uh, gets healed black hold but the fire immolation aura still kills and now they're gonna cyclone good good micro by the uh by the panda player uh, but just so much creep so much army and now i think they're going to focus down on the uh, on kunkka kunkka uh, just taking so much damage but two creeps still on him two creeps still on him i think he's going to get treant yeah he's going to get tree oh no oh he was trying to dodge stun oh oh are they on cooldown they're probably on cooldown they are low mana they're going to chase this this panda I'm not sure why they're chasing. They shouldn't be chasing. They're probably they should be probably uh, yeah going for a push middle or finish the Roshan. Uh, that that team fight definitely worked in the favor of of um, of the MYM team there. So yeah, they should just finish this Roshan and uh, get more go out of that uh, Mania. Save the Aegis for Mania. Mania could TP in in 18 seconds, things like that. So push your oh push your be careful. Don't don't die now. Uh, try to. Yeah, try to not lose any tower says You don't want to give these uh, the Sentinel team any burst uh, income right there. Uh, 1,000 is a big income. Everyone level up. I think they're saving it. The, yeah, there he goes. Uh, Mania picking up the Aegis. And he is going for Hex. So Hex is going to take care of the Panda, at least the Fire one. Uh, you can Hex it and, and you know it's, you don't have to worry about it for a while. But yeah. Um, so I was saying, uh, just thank, thanks for everyone that's been watching me for such a long time. I, I've been getting a lot of uh, comments saying that, oh yeah, I watch all your videos. Uh, thank you guys just just for just staying with me for so long. I, I never thought I would uh, be doing commentary for such a long time. And I never thought I would have so many subscribers. Uh, last time I checked, I had 600 something. But yeah, just I never expected you know, t me working uh, for you guys for such a long time. And I'm gonna keep doing at it. Uh, lately, I've been, uh, you know, spending a lot of time with my family. But I should be going back to my one-a-week schedule uh, when school started. When school starts, I want to thank a lot of uh, people specifically, uh, such as Tron, such as Al, Shin, and I see a lot of players that have showed up to um, the viewers' game. Had a fun time playing with you guys, and of course, a lot of people that have showed up to the RRC channel. Uh, we've been donating a lot uh, in in the couple uh, couple a week ago and things like that. Had a really fun time, um, and I want to extend a personal thank you to Nebula for doing a lot of dual commentaries with me, uh, and for doing dual commentaries with me that aren't aren't even uploaded, such as the VP vs MYM, and uh, just uh, Nebula's been playing a lot of Dota with me and, and forming the clan and things like that. So. Big shout out to Nebula for doing dual commentaries with me, as well as Photon Man for doing that one dual commentary with me. I'm not sure where you are now, but if you're watching this uh, commentary, I'm I'm free to do more commentary, uh, dual commentaries with you as well. And finally, I want to extend a big blanket thank you to everyone that has been uh, commenting, has been giving me Chris, uh, constructive criticism, has been PMing me. So thank you guys. Uh, without you guys, I probably have stopped uh, doing this a long time ago. So. Let's get back to this game. <laughs> MYM still pushing. Keep in mind they're probably a bit lower level because whenever they push, uh, five of their heroes are clumped up, and you know it only takes two or three heroes 
to kind of you know range the creeps uh, nuke the creeps and get a whole bunch of exp out of it if you can see that the uh, sentinel team generally quite ahead on level of course mania has been free farming for a long time and and miguel as well so <clears throat> looks like hex is up they have agus so so um uh, Necrolyte is going to charge in head first and, and uh, take as much damage as possible, nuke as many times as possible, expand his mana, and uh, they should just auto attack this Rax. Okay, so war goes down, Serpent War goes down, Torrent misses, um, ship is going to hit though, no, nice dodge by the Rasta. They kill Chen off, but Chen can't even use ultimate, and it uh, looks like this Fire Panda raging, <laughs> raging following, it looks like, oh, he will go down. Black hole one, two. Oh, black hole lasted for like two seconds, and it went down. Now mania goes in. Looks like crystal maiden will go down, and uh, they get cyclone. But this rex, this rex is gone. Yeah, this rex is gone. Suicide that rex. No, they get a, a nice blink. Good job right there. They do kill. Oh, they do kill the panda. So and they they're gonna get the avenge as well. So mania <laughs> picking up a triple kill owning, and uh, um, yeah, I think. Oh, the tower might range him, tower range him, and kill the hell out of him. And it looks like Furion should back up now. Furion does have book 3 at this point, but he's very, very gankable. No stun, no escape mechanism, other than his uh, TP. Uh, so, yeah, they only got a mid rest out of that, but that's one less lane uh, for this MYM to worry about, and one more lane for the Sentinel team to worry about, because these creeps could just push by themselves. As they apply pressure on the top and bottom lane, these, this lane is going to be big trouble for the MYM team, uh, for the Scourge team, um, and 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 uh, the Sentinel team has to keep it pushed at all times, so that dedicates at least one or two hero at middle lane, getting no XP, getting no gold, and make make them very very gankable. You can see that Melk is going for his Agamemnon Scepter. Agamemnon Scepter on Chen is really really strong. I think. The cooldown is like 30 seconds, you get a global heal. So that matters a lot when you have so many summons, so many creeps, and so many heroes that you have to heal at all times. But um, these guys are picking up their farm. Look, Kunga's Cleave um, is just so so strong against push strats because it just hurts so much target at, at, at once. Um, Kunga just farming up right now. Um, let me check creep kills for a minute. Kunga's 92, not even 100 yet. Beastmaster has 137 because he has an AoE nuke been uh, stopping pushes. Panda has absolutely nothing, but he does have six kills, so that's something there. Meanwhile on the on the Sentinel side on the Scourge side, there are absolutely no uh no creep kills other than Mania uh and Miguel. Oh actually Furion has a couple of creep kills from his ultimate I, I presume. Looks like the MYM team mounting up another push. Um they should be careful not getting ganked. Yeah he doesn't have the Aegis anymore. But no one's actually there. I think they're waiting for Chen to farm up his uh, scepter, I believe. Oh, this is a very, very good pushing creep. Dark Troll Lord, some of a lot of armies. But these aren't those those uh, skeletons are very you know nukeable, and the M uh, the Sentinel team has a lot of nukeage power, uh, AOE nuke. Oh, they're trying to power gank this tower, but tower is gonna get. No, oh, oh, power yeah, tower gets denied, and Ward is equal free gold at this point of the game. Not sure why Miguel uh, went solo by himself. I guess he saw the tower was low, so why not try? Ooh, nice, <laughs> nice rune right there, and then gets. Um, he's waiting for his mana to pack up. Why is his mana going up so slowly? The hell! He popped a regen rune just now. His mana should be going up like crazy, but I guess that was a little bit Dota bug, a uh, Dota bug right there. Um, so Miguel, not sure why he wasted that. Uh, <clears throat> that uh, his ultimate on there because now they can't really push without his ultimate being all back online. So now they have to posture even more. And oh, pusher getting caught by himself somehow, uh, feeding. Yeah. So uh, just I think that was a bad individual play because now the NYM team can't push without the the ultimate being online, or they shouldn't you know try pushing without the ultimate being online. Dandy going in, all these creeps are just free gold at this point. <laughs> Blue, Blue just picked up like ten creeps from there, uh, both from the tree ends and from the uh, from the uh, natural creeps of the scourge team. So let's see, Melk has there is an ultimate orb in base. Um, I think they're making another 
is this I can't click on this item if that's a, another bell of giant strength they're gonna go for another book I'm not sure book is limited or banned um, man I can't see the item that's on base so I, I'm just limited to seeing items that they're carrying looks like a lot of people are teeping panda's gonna get oh panda's gonna die panda's gonna get OT OT that panda there you go uh, now panda is forced to buy back does he even have buyback gold he I think he could make it for a buyback <clears throat> yeah, that he has to buy back, or they're gonna get racks because they need his ultimate definitely to to stop this push. I'm not sure why my team is going for the middle racks. Probably should go in middle and get bottom because the middle is already sort of pushed. And uh, oh, they are going bottom. There you go. Oh no, go for the bottom. No, they're they're staying middle. They're gonna get the range creep as well. Uh, Maine gets ultimate, uh, but he's gonna be okay. Pusher is still out here. He could jump in anytime. Um, Chen healing. Uh, Fire Panda, Fire Panda doing so much, they're stunning the Fire